Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a bunch of makeup and skincare products that BTS uses. But before we get started, I just want to let you guys know that 100% of the proceeds that's being made from AdSense in this video will 100% go to Black Lives Matter. I'm going to leave it in the description box along with my pinned comment on which organization that I choose to donate to along with how the money will be delivered. Whether it's this direct video, YouTube itself will send the AdSense money over or I will send the money over myself and I will obviously show proof on Twitter and in my videos, in my future videos, I will show proof that I have sent the money over. It will be 100% transparent with you guys. I want to raise money for Black Lives Matter and my BTS makeup and skincare videos are one of my videos where I make the most money on YouTube, like it gets the most views. So I will be putting quite a bit of ads in this particular video, but please, please, please watch the ads so we can raise money for Black Lives Matter. I really, really wanted to do something else that I haven't done yet in order to help this movement. I've already donated money, I've already signed petitions, I've been advocating for it on every single one of my social media platforms, and I have yet to do a YouTube video dedicated to Black Lives Matter where I donate all the proceeds to the um, to the movement. I really want to do this, so if you guys support me, please share this video or at least watch the ads so we can raise money together for Black Lives Matter. And if you are new to this channel, please subscribe down below give this video a thumbs up for me and hi my name is Sheila and let's get started okay so the first product I'm going to be showing you guys are these contacts these are the MTPR times BTS contacts and these are the gin ones I just want to show you guys quickly because these are the contacts that BTS are the face of so I don't have 100% proof that they do use these particular contacts but it makes sense to me if they do because the boys are such advocates and use products that they are the face of so it would make sense to me that they do use the MTPR contacts these are the gin ones in Destiny Blue, and I'm wearing them right now. I'm not sure if you can see on camera, but you can buy this on Yes Style along with all the other members. They have every single member has a different color, along with a group color contact pack. And you can use my code SheilaBooey on Yes Style. I think you, you do get like five to ten percent off. So if you want to use my name, you can get a discount off of Yes Style. If you don't, I really don't care. But I just thought I would quickly mention this since we are doing a BTS makeup and skincare video that they do have a color contact line that I do think they do use. All right, now on to actual skincare. This particular product, this is the Biora face wash. Again, you can buy this on Yes Style. This video is not sponsored by Yes Style. I swear I bought all these products with my own money. This is a foaming cleanser. Biora in Japan and Korea. It's actually one of my favorites, like just line in general. Their sunscreen is absolutely incredible. If you have never tried Biora sunscreen, I highly recommend. So when I saw this in the back picture, I think it was sitting on the makeup table of the boys. So I just assumed that the makeup artist will probably use this on them before they do their makeup just to make sure their skin is clean and fresh for makeup and for the application. There is actually no scent but it foams up in your hand, it lathers up and it was quite inexpensive. You can get it on Yes Style, you can get it on Amazon. I hate this product. I don't recommend it. I did a whole video where I try out BTS Jimin's skincare routine for a whole week and this was the cleanser that I chose because it was Jimin in the photo where the Biora face wash was behind. So I tried this out for a whole week. Not even, I think I tried this out for like three to four days and it broke me out really, really bad. So I particularly don't like this face wash, but if you guys want to try it out, go right ahead. It's only a few dollars and maybe it works. It will work for you. It works for Jimin clearly, which is why they use it on him. But for me, it's definitely a hard pass. I don't really like it. The next one, this is so freaking funny. I didn't know it was this at first. I realized it after watching one of the run episodes. I don't know exactly which episode it was, but in one of the run episodes, the boys were doing a skit and it was like a commercial and Jungkook, well, like, instead of like spraying on his face because this is the VT times BTS Born Natural Gel Mist and it's basically just a hydrating mist. It's not a setting spray. It's one of those mists where you kind of just spray it on your face to make it, it's like a refresh your spray basically and I'm gonna show you guys the mist it's a really 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 fine mist there's a little bit of a scent to it and I do really enjoy this and VT did send this to me so I just want to be transparent with you guys but I do really really enjoy their mist from VT Cosmetics this was the mist that JK used in the video and instead of spraying on his face he was like oh I have like foundation and makeup on he sprayed it on his like what is this called um your it's not your elbow. He sprayed it on his wrist and then he just put it on his neck, which I thought it was really funny now actually owning the product because I'm just really confused. Why are you spraying a face mist on your wrist? I, I get why he did it, but like I'm still confused because it's a face mist and not like a cologne where you put on your neck. 
but this is a product he uses and I do like this for just a refresher spray but again it's just a nice product it's like kind of like a leisure product where you can use if you want to just refresh your face throughout the day also by the way a few of these products will be from VT Cosmetics because VT does send me a few items from time to time to try out or I'll request items from VT here and there and some of these items since BTS is the face of VT Cosmetics I do have a whole line with them they, the boys obviously use the items so the next one I'm going to be talking about is the VT Cosmetics Time Sika Care and just Jimin actually uses, not uses, but he posed with these products. I don't know for sure if he uses, but VT definitely gifted it to them and then he posted a picture on Twitter. And the products I'm going to be talking about are the Sika Cream and the Sika Excellent Sunscreen. Again, I did a whole video with Jimin and trying out his skincare routine for a whole week and these products were mentioned. I love this cream. If you are looking for a good dupe for the Belief Gel moisturizer this is pretty much it it's really good and i think there is fragrance in it because it does have that sika scent but it's not anything that's too potent it's a lightweight gel moisturizer and i personally really like using this under my makeup i like gel moisturizer to put underneath my makeup because i have really 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 oily skin but I don't like using this day to day because currently right now I have very dry skin so my skin needs extra hydration. My skin is really acting weird lately but under makeup this is amazing. It's a super lightweight moisturizer that does not make you oily and it just it soaks into your skin relatively fast since it is a gel consistency. If you are new here your girl is the biggest advocate for sunscreen. Please wear sunscreen and try to wear sunscreen with SPF 50, not the whole like SPF 15. You need a higher SPF than just SPF 15. I personally like SPF 50 and I like using the Asian sunscreens. They're just way better than any American brand sunscreens ever. This is the VT Cosmetics Sika Essence Sun Sunscreen SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 which I believe is the highest PA you can get and the PA just basically means that it the PA is the ingredient where it helps your skin reduce wrinkle like it protects your skin from getting wrinkly from the sun I really like the sunscreen I'm very actually picky with my sunscreen as hard as that is to believe I only use two sunscreens and it's the Biora one it's the Japanese brand Biora sunscreen and this is what the sunscreen looks like and actually the sunscreen has a little bit of a fragrance or a scent to it but it's something that will make me angry not angry but like annoyed where I won't use it I hate I hate 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 fragrances in my skincare but if I choose to use the skincare with fragrance in it I actually really really like the product so I don't mind the scent in this at all it just smells like Sika it's smells really like minty. I really really like this and it soaks into my skin very very fast. Doesn't make my face oily throughout the day. It's a good sunscreen and it doesn't leave a white cast on your face either. Along with posing next to the VT Cosmetics Sika skincare line, Jimin also posed next to the Cushion Foundation. This is the VT Cosmetics Cushion Foundation for the Sika line. I really like this. Do I recommend this as an actual foundation to wear to a concert? Um, maybe for me, I wouldn't recommend just because, again, I have very, very, very oily skin. You can see the oiliness of my skin peeking through in this video. I have extremely oily skin, so this will not last me at a concert. But, first of all, the coverage for this is really good. It's medium to full coverage. It's good for oily skin. It does last, like, a good amount of time. It just doesn't last all day. You will get oily throughout the day. So, I wouldn't recommend wearing this for a longer period of time, but for, like, three to five hours if you're just running errands I would treat this as more of like a tinted moisturizer that's what I wear it as whenever I need to go out and do errands and out and about I will use this because it's such an easy lightweight foundation I don't feel like I have makeup on when I use this and it has good coverage and it looks natural one thing that's pretty unfortunate about VT's cushion foundation is that the shade range is pretty limited but to be honest Korean brands the cushion foundations the shade range is always very limited i think this is the shade m23 i mean i believe this is the darkest shade in the line so if you are a darker complexion than i am i would say pass on this but if you are my complexion or lighter definitely check it out if you want a good cushion foundation to try out i really like it so if you guys are ever wondering how bts makes sure their hair is like perfectly in place for every interview, every concert ever, they use the L'Oreal hairspray. I I have used this hairspray before BTS, before I even found out BTS uses this. On the makeup artist table with BTS in the back, you can see the L'Oreal hairsprays. And this one is the L'Oreal Elnet Satin. This is the extra strong holds volume. But honestly, any L'Oreal hairspray 
will work. Their hairspray is so good. I have been using their hairspray for years, like years. Every single makeup artist I know raves about the L'Oreal hairspray. It just, it's really good. It doesn't leave your hair crunchy, your hair lasts you all day, and it just doesn't look like you have hairspray on, but your curls will last. I don't have it on today because I'm just at home. But usually when I'm at a BTS concert and I curl my hair at 100%, I will use this hairspray and my curls will last all day and I have six straight Asian hair. So this is a lifesaver. I truly love this hairspray. If you guys want a good hairspray, strongly check this out. I really, really like it a lot. In the BTS world, the boys are really known for the skincare and the chopstick that they use. So the first one, in my part two, in my BTS, makeup and skincare video. I reviewed the Nivea tinted lip balms, but I wasn't able to get the exact shade. The next product is the Nivea lip balm, and Jungkook actually uses this. There is like advertisements of his face on with a lip balm everywhere in Asia. You can Google it, but this is the strawberry one. He's known for using the strawberry and the peach one, and let me just tell you right now, like, I reviewed the raspberry one in my previous makeup and skincare BTS video, but, because I wasn't able to find the strawberry one. The strawberry one, I was only able to find on eBay. And at eBay, they sell it for $15. But then I found it on YesStyle, where they sold it for $4. So shout out to YesStyle for being the biggest plug. But unfortunately, they sold out on the website for YesStyle. If I can find another link where they sell the strawberry lip balm, I will leave a link to it down below. But anyways, this lip balm is, you guys, amazing, beautiful. I love this lip balm. I wish I bought more. I love this color. I'm not gonna say it's like the most moisturizing lip balm in the entire world, but for a tinted lip balm, it gives you the most beautiful color ever. It gives you just enough color to where it looks like your lips are super, super healthy and red, but it's a very natural red. I'm gonna try to swatch it, but I don't, I don't really know how you can swatch the balms. You can kind of see. It's like the sheerest tint of red. But it just makes your lip look so good. I I love this lip balm and the scent isn't too too strong. I hate scents in lip products and the scent for this is not strong at all. So I freaking love this lip balm. I wish I bought more. The next one is this one. I believe Namjoon actually uses this. This is the Burt's Bee Tinted Lip Balm. And it's in the shade Hibiscus. I got this on Amazon but I'm pretty sure you can get it on YesStyle or Amazon. And I'm gonna swatch it for you guys. This one actually has a bit of color. Personally, for me, Burt's Bee lip balms, not really my favorite. I think they're okay. I like this one because it is very glossy and it glides on your lips like butter, while this one does take a little bit more effort to put on. But this one just glides on and it has a lot of pigmentation. So if you don't want a lip balm with a lot of pigmentation, you might wanna skip out on this. But I'm gonna put it on right now. It gives your lips like a glossy finish. The moisturizing aspect of it is not really that moisturizing at all. It's not moisturizing at all. I wouldn't like, I wouldn't wear this for the moisture aspect of it, but if you like the color, if you like a light glossy lip where it's not too much and it does hydrate your lip just a little bit, I would recommend it. But out of these two, this one is my absolute favorite. Like I cannot live without this stuff. It is so good. It's better than the fresh lip balm that the boys use. The fresh one is kind of really, really expensive. This one is like $4, but the fresh one is a lot easier to find, obviously, but this stuff is so good. <laughs> and that's the end of the video. I love you guys so, so, so much. If you guys are currently protesting right now, please, please stay safe. Wear a mask. Be sure to be protective. Bring gloves. Bring snacks. Just please stay safe. I love you guys. And if you ever need anything, you can always reach out to me on my social media. My Twitter and Instagram handle is right there. I'm going to constantly be advocating for Black Lives Matter. And also, every I think I will be posting the money either on Twitter or Instagram, but it will most likely be Twitter because a lot of you guys follow me on Twitter as well And it's just easier to post on Twitter so you guys can always refer back to my tweets So I will be sure to include the proof of the donations on my Twitter along with the proof on my videos as well Just in case you don't have a Twitter so you can see that I actually donated the money of this video to Black Lives Matter And also if you want to match my donation that I've already made personally with my own money to Black Lives Matter I'll leave a link to my tweet down below and you can match my tweet and just retweet it and match my tweet and donate to Black Lives Matter I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!